On today's episode, we're gonna take a look at the guitar. It's finally finished after a week's hard work, and I think it looks pretty good. I hope you're gonna enjoy this. You've seen me build this guitar, even though you haven't seen all the little steps in between, but you haven't really seen the whole picture. It's been a fun little experiment to try to make a guitar in one week, roughly. It's a little bit more than one week, but I'm giving myself this. Um, so, we're gonna take a look at the guitar, and then, once we've looked at how it looks, we're gonna hear how it sounds, and, you know, figure out how it sounds. It's gonna be very interesting and, and fun, especially for me, because I don't know how it sounds, and it's gonna be interesting to, you know, see if, if you can make a guitar this way. I've ob obviously checked the electronics to make sure they work, but I don't know what kind of tones or sounds are really kind of coming out of it, so it's gonna be interesting. So let's take a look at the guitar, should we? Here it comes. Look at this. It's a... I like this. It looks really nice. Some cool combinations of natural woods and the way they look. It sounds nice. And it looks good. It's a very thin body, as you can see. I hope you remember the, the whole idea was to make this neck, which is basically just, you know, the, the idea of sandwiching around the truss rod instead. I hope you remember that from watching the videos, or that if you didn't watch the videos, you're going and taking a look at them now, so you understand what I'm talking about. But the real question really is, how does it sound? <laughs> I think you and I both know, that you know, that I know, that what we need is to hear how this guitar sounds with some distortion, right? And I'm thinking, you know, maybe something that everyone agrees is the most awesome pedal ever made, something that is like the best of the best, but still a classic, still has those sounds that everyone is looking for. Boss. And I have the box which you must have, and all the papers that come with. And I'm thinking, you know, DS1. <laughs> just one V90. What do you think? Let me know. Anyway, I know what you're saying. You're saying to yourself, man, that, that's great. That's cool. That's awesome. That's really, really great. But you know what? We kind of need to hear it through the weirdest pedals you have, just making crazy 
noise and being all mad scientist about it. And I'm, I'm sorry, but I, I, I just, if I plug it through all my weirdest pedal, it's just gonna be, you know, it's just gonna be basically white noise and it's not gonna work. So let's not do that. Instead, let's just take some of the weird pedals that I have. <laughs> it for a song but maybe you will you know who knows anyway that's basically it you know uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video I hope there was some sort of enjoyment you got out of it I hope you guys will stick around because I have a lot more crazy things going on um, this is definitely the most normal guitar I've ever made <laughs> so I hope you will enjoy other things that are to come this has been a really fun thing. I, I really enjoy this whole guitar challenging thing. Making all people build whatever they have in their mind. And I've seen some really amazing things that people have made. So I'm really, really grateful that this awesome idea was put together. And thank Crimson Guitar for that. And also thanks all the lovely people out there who have given me really nice comments. It's been... A, it's been really warming to me to, to see how nice people can be, um, especially since there is a lot of negativity around right now and I haven't really gotten any negativity. So thank you all for that and, um, you know, keep the positivity around, you know, just keep on being nice to people as, for as long as you can. And we'll see you in the next video. Okay, bye bye.